they go to the loo. Happy boom, oh, happy boom, oh, oh, happy boom, oh, happy boom, oh, 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 oh. 93% of people like you take their phones when they go to the loo. Happy boom, oh, happy boom, oh, oh, happy boom, oh, happy boom, oh, 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 oh. 93% of people like you take their phones when they go to the loo. Happy boom, oh, happy boom, oh, oh, happy boom, oh, happy boom, oh, 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 oh. 93% of people like you. And check this out, guys. I just wanted to show you guys that I found this here in uh, the United States today. Hot sauce flavored Lay's. I ain't got real now, guys. So, uh, I'm doing a two for one -er today. Uh, just, uh, I was, the first one was a, um, recording of, uh, I was, uh, doing a video with you guys. So, uh, thank you guys for joining me on that. Um, but, uh, yeah, um, today, uh, I was feeling kind of down and stuff because I went to the hospital. I wasn't feeling good. So now I'm feeling pretty good, and so, uh, but um, this bad boy is going to be coming out later, um, either this week or next week. I'll uh, get that one going, and then I got this little guy. I think this guy is going to kill me, but uh, I'm going to rip him open later and uh, see um, uh what he kind of tastes like, if he's going to kill me or not. Uh, but I got a bunch of stuff here. I got uh, the bomb uh, from the show Hot Ones uh, up on here. So uh, we're going to be doing that as well. But uh, let's go ahead and uh, I'm going to try this one, the hot sauce uh, flavored ones. I'm not recording this uh, for my, my channel, but I'm going to go ahead and taste this one. And, uh, I mean, let you guys know how it tastes. It's a... Uh, I don't know if you guys can see that. Uh, Frank's Red Hot um, Hot Sauce. I don't know why they use Frank's Red Hot, but uh, it is what it is. Hot sauce flavored. So uh, we're going to get that shot here. Uh. So how are you guys doing out there? I know I haven't been coming on live very much, but um, uh, I'm trying. Um, to get on a little bit more for you guys um i've just been busy and bombarded with uh my channel um i have hot sauce or i'm sorry uh food carts coming out here uh, shortly i just got done filming two of them um last uh last week so that'll be coming out here shortly but uh yeah um i don't know these are kind of these are weird. It's not even hot. It does have the Frank's Red Hot Sauce in it. Um, but it's not hot at all. It has a little bit of tang and heat to it. But um, otherwise, it's, it's, it's not it's not like flaming hot or anything. But uh, it's pretty good. So I got that one. And then um, we're going to try this. Uh, I got this three of these today or not today but like uh two weeks ago sauces of wrath um she wanted me to try these out basically to see what it tastes like give them a rating and then you know put it on youtube but um i want to go ahead and give this one a shot with you guys because you're my family and i'm going to try this out just for you guys so uh let's see here all right Sauces of Wrath. So I guess this one is the uh, it has a seven out of ten uh, heat rating on it. I don't know if you guys can see that or not. Um, it looks like a jalapeno. It says it has habaneros, serranos, and uh, but it looks almost like a, a jalapeno sauce. Almost. So let's go ahead and get this one a shot. Um, all right. I'm gonna take that 
that stupid top off. I hate those things. All right. Yeah, you can definitely smell the Serranos in there. Um, that looks kind of thick. Hi, Tina. How you doing? Thank you for watching, guys. All right. So we're going to give that one a shot here. Check that out. I almost think it has more vinegar in it this time. Let's see here, I'm gonna give that a shot. That's actually a pretty good, that's a good flavor to that one. Um, Habanero Serranos. Lime. I definitely taste the lime in there. It's making my uh, mouth salivate. This is a really good sauce. Um, have you guys tried the sauces of Wrath yet? Or if you uh, uh, acquired any of that down there um, over where you guys are living? Uh, but uh, yeah, this, this, this one is very flavorful, has great taste, not over vinegared. Um, I don't know if you guys can see that. There's a, I think there's like traces of the Serrano peppers in there. Um, I see a lot of the jalap or habanero in there. It's not uh, jalapenos. Uh, it does have some um, habaneros in there. Uh, I could definitely taste that in there. A lot of seeding. There's a lot of seeds in there. Um, I don't know what it is with some sauces. I, for me, as uh, in my own opinion and my own taste. Uh, I like sauces that don't have seeds in it, uh, just simply because I don't like to chew through them. Um, but I, rather, I like to have it go straight through my uh, down my uh, esophagus and straight down in my stomach because that's that's where I could taste most of the flavors. Because if I get a seed hung up or whatever, then it's like game over pretty much for me. But uh, I'm gonna give this one another shot because this one just this was pretty good flavoring on it. Definitely lime in there. It has a good little heat to it. Not, it doesn't have too much of a kick. But this is something like I, I put on like a, like on my burrito or something. Uh, tastes really good. Really s solid going down. Again, the seeds are a little bit of an issue, but that I could overlook. Um, but this sauce. I'm going to give this one a pretty good rating, um, 7.9. That was a good, uh, good sauce to it. Um, really good taste, really great flavor, not too overly hot. Uh, so, Sauces of Wrath. The Tale of Two Chilies is what it's called. So, uh, yeah. They're, uh, from what I heard, they sell this on Amazon. So, check them out and, uh, yeah. So that's my review, guys, and uh, it was a pleasure uh, doing two live feeds for you guys tonight. Uh, not too um, long from getting out of the hospital, so <laughs> that's a uh, an accomplish accomplishment for me. Um, this one, this bad boy, will be ripped out. I think I'm going to try out next week. Um, I've been practicing. Um, I don't. I've I've been practicing with these. I've been putting 50, gra 50 grams on a scale. Yeah, these are Taco Bell Fire uh, chips, guys. Um, I've been practicing with those maybe like twice a day. I can put a little bit of hot sauce on it on the way down, but I've been hitting a minute and eighteen seconds. Um, so hopefully I could hit that and uh, try to get that record. So uh, yeah. Um, so I look forward to doing that for you guys, and uh, I'll see you guys on the next one. Bye now.